Hey everyone, it's Leszek Nowotarski from Ledo Music and today I'll be comparing these three horns which you can see just behind me. The first one is my main horn, this is Kaylord SX90, the middle one is Yamaha Yas32 and the third one, cheapest one, is this is um, Chinese Toman product, it's called Starton SAS75. So if you're interested, please stay with me and let's start the comparison. As I said at the beginning, I'll be comparing these three horns. This is my main horn. I've been playing this horn for um, 23 years already. I bought it in 97. It was um, already three times overall. In my opinion, this is best horn ever, comparing value to sound which this horn produces. This is, as I said, my backup horn. This is also from uh, middle 90s, as serial number says here. I bought it about six months ago. Um, uh, it was in the mint condition. It didn't need any um, uh, serious overall, um, just few repairments, just few um, uh, pad replacement. I I need a uh, horn for uh, education purposes. I bought extra light uh, case uh, from Protec to this. I need to get to work uh, by bicycle, so I need extra light case for this Yamaha. So this is only for school purposes. And the third horn, which you can see here, is some um, um, Chinese Toman uh, $300 uh, saxophone. This is some um, my student horn. He bought it. He played this horn couple times and he uh, decided to switch to tenor so this one is for sale and I'll be comparing these three horns together with the uh, with two mount pieces one first mount pieces is my main uh, mount piece this is Teowing Gaia 2 interesting thing that this Gaia mount piece costs about this is expensive one uh, cost about $600 so uh, as you can imagine this is twice uh, more expensive this this whole horn Chinese and uh, I'll be comparing this with the kit mount piece which uh, comes with this um, Chinese start on uh, horn and let's see how these three horns uh, sound with uh, these two mount pieces so now let's go to the comparison <laughs> So what was the purpose of this episode? Um, I decided to make this episode because 
as you can see the differences between these three horns are not so obvious they all sounds pretty decent but on one condition you need to use good mountpiece with this kit mountpiece all three horns sound like a crap so um uh, if you decide to buy a saxophone you can save money on horn you can of course buy a cheaper horn actually do not buy this uh cheapest ever saxophone 300 dollars is is not enough probably it will um, cause a problems in a um, couple months so if you want to uh, save money buy cheap yamaha why yamaha why i decided to buy um, yamaha as my backup also i have here um this is tenor um uh, yamaha 55 they are to my backup horn because um yamaha is uh, is a good service Th these are pretty decent horn even though they are student models 32 and 52 they are two uh, student models but trust me they are very good horns so if you want to buy a um, um, student middle uh, shelf uh, horn, you can for sure buy Yamaha 32, Yamaha 55. And of course, if you want to sell it in a couple months, couple years, you will sell Yamaha, trust me, in one, two weeks. This is very easy horn to sell. That's why I, I choose um, uh, these uh, Yamaha horns as, as my backup, because if I decided to uh, switch my backup, probably I will sell it uh, with no uh, problem. So um, coming back to, to, to what I wanted to say, if you want to complete the, the saxophone setup, do not uh, save money on mount pieces. If mount piece costs $600, trust me, it's worth it. So um, uh, you can save money on the horn. You, can, you, you don't have to buy uh, as a startup, I don't know, Yamaha 62, Yamaha 82, you can buy Yamaha 32. And add extra money trust me for decent mount piece which is easy to blow which won't kill you and bash your and and mount piece which will meet your sound expectation trust me the mount piece is more important than the rest of the body the rest of the saxophone good mount piece with the appropriate read trust me will produce better sound even on the cheapest saxophone than the shitty mount piece with a um, good horn with the high value saxophone. Thank you very much for today. Sorry for my English mistakes. I'm not native as you can hear, I'm from Poland. Uh, if you like my video, please give me the thumb up. You can share this video. You can um, subscribe, of course, my channel. Uh, so you won't miss anything what um, will show on my channel in the future. What you can see here, of course, many gear tests like this. But also I, I do the uh, online courses, I do the uh, Skype messenger saxophone lessons, improvisation, music theory and, and jazz stuff. So if you're interested, please contact me, mail is over here. I'm a saxophonist from Poland, my name is Leszek Nowotarski. So uh, I hope I will see you next time in the next episode. Goodbye. Thank mm -hmm. you.